What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, hit that subscribe button, give it a like, make sure you have that bell notification turned on. In tonight's video guys, we're going to be messing with the Mini and the EG6. My brother got a few new bits and pieces for the EG6 to keep it original, but um, <laughs> it's far from original. But um, we're going to check out my door cards that Alan Dunn from cleanmycard.ie slash reaper detailing. Um, he used his own product on it that he will be doing hopefully soon. Uh, that will be available to the public ASAP, I say. Hopefully he gets it on the run soon. Um, we're going to fit my door cards. We're also going to check out what Aaron got. And we're going to do a good tidy up in this garage because it really needs it. So guys, enjoy the video. Peace out. So first off guys, what we're going to do is obviously we're going to open this bonnet once I move this old mirror. Stick it up here. These clocks that I brought down, they're on my Civic, but they're all the ones because he needs bulbs out of them. So we are going to connect the battery. Make sure it's fully connected. Close that down. And then show you the really fun stuff. So guys, don't mind the colour. They will be done. I don't know whether he's going to do them yellow to match the car. I honestly think he should either get them dipped in carbon or just do them a nice gloss black. So, yeah, this is the nice thing about these mirrors and they're really hard got and they're really expensive. But EG6 SIR2, optional extras. How cool is that? And they work perfect for the car. Open and close. Awesome. So enough of that Civic. Let's have a look at my door cards and see how really clean they came up. So guys, you'll see in a previous video, I gave these door cards a good clean, a good scrub. But obviously it wasn't good enough because they were still absolutely filthy. The dirt was in the leather really, really, really good. I don't know why, but that trip switch keeps tripping with them hot lights on. So we're going to have to sort something with that. But yeah, they came out so good. So much better. Look how clean they are. They are so good. This one had a big mark in it as well. You can see all the dirt came out of it. And it has left a little bit of a line there. But you can see how clean the dog card came out. It's so much better. So, so much better. So Alan done a really, really, really good job. So that's Alan from cleanmycard.ie. Uh, check out the page if you want any of your gear done. He's he's well priced. He does a great job, an unbelievably good job. So if you want to check him out and check out the website, they do do products for cleaning your stuff. You can buy leather cleaners. Also, Revel do a really, really, really good leather cleaner. I'm actually going to get a few off them because my interior is going to be leather. This is leather and of a few other leather bits and pieces in the house that it can be used on because... There's no harm in having a good leather cleaner around because if you do have leather, you need it. Haven't seen this paint in a few days, but oof, so good. So, so good. And it still needs a flat and polish. And it's so yummy. So, yeah, I cut a little out in here. So I'm going to open the door and I'm going to test fit the door card and see how she looks. But I also need to fix this window. I don't think it's on the rail properly. So I'm just going to stick it on a time lapse of me throwing it on and then fixing the window. So after messing with this for a while, I think it's the last cause. This is way too rusty. So we went through the inventory and we have a fresh glass over there. So I'm just gonna grab it over here and give it a good wash. Hopefully it washes up as good and as clean as this one is. So let's give it a go. So 
So Aaron said the windows are a one-man job, not a bleeding hope. I had to give Aaron to give me a hand because Aaron to, had to do it. Aaron had to do it, yeah. We can do it, but on his own. We, one-man we, job. We help. Just there. So it's in now, it's working, going up and down. The glass isn't too bad. There's a few scratches in it, but we'll get Reaper to have a look at it and give it a polish. But you can see through it and it goes up and down and it doesn't fall out when you're driving. So I'm going to get this door card put on and get all my other bits and pieces put on. So that's all the trims on the inside and the outside done on door card on window winder window winder on and I'm just gonna stick one of these bad boys around the steering wheel to have the inside of the car smelling nice and fresh when we come back down and work on it. So I have to get the car pulled out and we'll get that side done next time. Um that window needs to go in and the rear window is in, but the seal around it needs to go in. And then this top dash rail is coming out. I'm getting the new top dash rail put in. And then obviously the windscreen can go in. And then once Aaron gets his mini back to his house, I can get the interior out of it. Do it tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow. Yeah, I will actually. Do you know what? I will. Okay, so I'm going to hang this up. So Aaron's going to do his inner arches on the Civic and he goes, grab them there. So I grabbed them out and I says, oh, this must be left or right. And he goes, oh, sure, there's labels on them. Good labels. Good labels, huh? I didn't say good. Grand. What did you say? I said labels. I didn't say good labels. <laughs> there's labels on them. <laughs> that says Fender F or front right. So you're able to read that? Yeah. No, 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 no. You can't read the label, but it says beside the label, in the plastic, Fender FR. So the label led you to that? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh. Good labels. So we're gonna put the inner arches on this Civic, but we don't have any clips. So I'm gonna go and get iron clips tomorrow. And um, we also stuck that in with a bit of gunk. So that stays in and um, we done the other side. It's not in yet, but this side, as you can see, isn't in yet, but it does definitely need to go in. And then that arch as well is going to go under there, but we don't have any clips tonight, so we're not going to get that done tonight. So that's all I'm going to get done for tonight. Yeah, them headrests are fun to do. Not very fun, but algae's done. So guys, that's enough messing for the night. We got a bit done on the Mini. We got a bit more done on the Civic. I'm gonna be down here during the week to do a massive clear out. We're gonna clear out all the shelves and get rid of what's on the floor. In, up tidy, get everything sorted so we have more room in the garage to walk around. Now guys, don't forget, check out the website, check out the new goods, Jet Tags. They also have new car scent air fresheners, they actually smell amazing. I have one hanging up in the Mini now, make the car smell fresh when I get the windows in, it'll smell nice. There's two of them in the Civic, Aaron bought two off me and he stuck them in the Civic. So yeah guys, if you want to support the channel and help me in what I'm doing, grab some merch, grab some accessories. And yeah guys, I'll see you in the next video. Um, hopefully down here will be 100% better. We're going to tidy up everything. I'm going to get new racking and shelving and stuff and tidy the place up. It does need another paint. Um, this wall behind me is looking fresh up until here you see. So we're going to get it all done. Um, so yeah guys, I will see you in the next videos. And I want to thank you all. Again, 3000 plus subscribers, I can't believe it. 
following a, a ginger Reuters dude on YouTube. <laughs> so yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next video and I really do appreciate you for watching. So thank you very much and see you in the next one. Peace out.